In Far Cry 3 we play as Jason. He is on vacation with the most generic side characters you can think of. By the time the screen Project X video ends, you want all these guys already dead. By skydiving the group lands on a pirate island and they get kidnapped by Vas, a notorious phone collector. This is a nice phone. He wants to set the group into slavery, but Jason and his brother Grant manage to escape. He's a veteran by the way. That is what they teach you in the army. Here we take control of Jason and learn some basic gameplay elements, like distracting enemies. I guess it's also what they teach in the army. After revealing his master plan, he gets shot. We're gonna free the others, and then we're going home. Sorry bro, but I am not touching that. <laughs> Running away from the bad guys, we get some help from a Rakia tribe member, whose name is Dennis. He gives us the tribe's tattoos, and some cash for- You like what you see, I can tell. We are going to search for our friends for the rest of the game by doing side missions for the tribe. <laughs> In like two missions we find and confront our lost brother's girlfriend, Daisy. She was so shocked about the news she immediately looked for another f <laughs> These beans ain't loyal. I'll be fine. By looking for the rest of the family we get captured by Vas. Then we escape to the safe house with Lisa. The new plan is to restore the old rusty boat, which will be fixed by Daisy, so we can leave the island. We will never leave this place. Next we get invited to a sacred temple to meet Citra, the priestess of the Rakya tribe. We have no time to waste, so we give her what she really wants. I found you, on the beach. From now we'll be looking for an ancient knife and the clues lead us to Brad Pitt. He gives us info about our friends, the big boss Hoyt and the hitman Buck, who helps us to find the knife. In the end we kill his <laughs> to save our friend Keith. After doing more and more missions we become a real member of the tribe and we are setting up an ambush to save innocent lives. Did I ever tell you the definition of insanity? But in reality it was an ambush set up by Vas to kidnap Jason. Surviving his and Citra's games we can finally finish him off. Regaining consciousness next to Citra, Jason promises her to kill Hoyt, leaving his so-called friends behind. Then we jump on a plane with Brad to reach Hoyt's private island, where we meet his old CIA friend, Sam. He will help us blending in with the other mercenaries to earn Hoyt's trust, so we can kill him in person. At Hoyt's HQ we find our younger brother in a cell, and we prepare to finish him off in a stylish poker game. He knew we were going to betray him, and he kills Sam in front of us. Yes, he's sitting this one out. In like 5 seconds of QTEs he managed to kill him. He was one of the most underwhelming last bosses ever. Escaping the scene with our bro, we discovered that Citra ordered the tribe to kidnap all of our friends. As we hurry up to confront her, she drugs us, which causes us to hallucinate some unreal sh She wants to confuse us with portraying Lisa as the bad girlfriend. I mean, nice tie Citra, but I already f***ed you and the Freeing our friends triggers Dennis from nowhere to come and stab us, but he misses and kills Citra instead. Mission failed. Bro, it wasn't even close. And finally we can leave the island behind on the rusty boat. Please, I'm coming. 